great day to you. So the famous philosopher, psychologist Sigmund Freud, he claimed that the reason why a human being wakes up in the morning is because they want to fulfill their pleasures, their lusts of life. And he wasn't that wrong, but he wasn't perfectly right. He wasn't wrong because pleasure is the drive of life. But he wasn't that right. That's because the question is which pleasure. So you had a great thinker named Viktor Frankl who came after him. Very accepted theory who says, of course pleasure is your drive in life. Why you wake up in the morning. But which pleasure? Just a passing temporary momentary pleasure? Or long-term pleasure that brings you internal joy, internal happiness. And he says the real reason why you wake up in the morning as a human being is because deep in your psychology and your subconscious of your instinctive nature as a human, not an animal, you have this dream of making others happy through your actions. And that's long-lasting internal pleasure that lasts for days and months, which is the reason why you wake up in the morning. In Hasidic teachings it says that pleasure is the reason of growth. When we have pleasure, we grow. The Rebbe says that when a mother cradle, cradles a child, a baby, and nurses the baby, it's not just the protein of the milk that is causing the baby's body to grow. It's actually the pleasure, the coziness that the baby experiences that makes the body grow and get big. There's a story in the Talmud that there was a king named Aspasianus, or some people may have called him Titus, Titus was one of his other names, that when he heard that his father died and he inherited the whole kingdom of the Romans, the Roman Empire, he was in the middle of bathing, and he put on his first shoe out of his right foot, but when he tried to put on his shoe of his left foot, it couldn't go on, because his foot expanded. That points out this idea that pleasure, joy, internal pleasure, makes you grow. And the Rebbe writes that there was a great tzaddik named Reb Nachman of Chernobyl, who it was said about him specifically, versus other people and even other righteous people, that he was fat physically from the pleasure of prayer. So pleasure is good. Good, long-lasting, real deep pleasure. Teach yourself, let's teach ourselves to have pleasure, bringing pleasure to others. And Mashiach will come right now.